Gary, Gary Verge in Bordertown, just live a couple of k's north of Bordertown. I farm with my wife and three daughters. Uh, we crop probably roughly 2,400 hectares, just canola, wheat, then beans, just a third, third, just keep it simple. Uh, this is my third G6 in a row. They've all been 36 metres. We run a control traffic system of 12 metre passes and it works and yeah, they've all been the same. We've sort of been running the three tier technology that, yeah, I love it. That you can vary your speeds a bit and keep your uh, spray pattern correct. The changeover was very good and the running, the running of the gold acres allows me to upgrade without too big a cost. Uh, I run the Raven XRT system and I think it's a lot better responsive with the hydraulics as well. We probably used to have to just back off a little bit going through drains and stuff, but now it just follows the ground beautifully and probably uh, yeah, limits drift and the boom, you know, the boom going swaying all over the place is a lot of the drift issues and we can just hug the ground everywhere so we can spray with confidence in a lot of weather conditions. Yeah, really like the gold acres. I've got the 20.842s. We, we do get quite wet. So yeah, the flotation and the light weight of the machine really helps. And yeah, it is four wheel drive and I think that keeps it up on top a lot better too. The comfort of the G6 is very nice. And yeah, you can sit there for long, long times and you're up high and the vision of the boom makes it. If you can ever have an enjoyable environment for working, I think the G6 has nailed it. The G-Hub system, uh, just getting used to it, but really enjoying just dialing up and putting the leaders in the tank and not overflowing the tank and rushing around, putting the chemical in and you end up with too much water and the pump the speed of the pump of filling the tank is very, very efficient. Fuel economy and the maintenance costs are very low. So really enjoy the gold acres, that's for sure. The height control does allow me better coverage on the plant and yeah, just minimising drifts. It's just win-win, I think. This one's got an onboard pump where I don't have to use firefighters and stuff no more. And yeah, just the efficiencies are very good that I can fill up at other sources without taking anything with me. And I think it's doing 11 or 1200 litres a minute. So very quick and very efficient. Especially a year like last year with all the rainfall, probably most things got three fungicides and I might've even done the beans four times. So yeah, the boom spray didn't stop too much and a couple of knock, couple of knockdowns in front of seeding and a summer spray so yeah you could get five six seven passes so yeah the boom spray is a very important part of my mach machinery that's for sure it's a three-tier system and which allows me to vary the sp speed a little bit and keep the pattern so yeah enjoy that I've got 015s and 02s and when the pressure builds up on the 015 it changes to the 02 and when the pressure builds up on the 02 they'll both kick in so yeah it allows a broad spectrum of your speed that you sort of can get away with. My new one's got 16 sections so that reduces the overlap and chemical yeah which is pretty important because you can't you can see the damage of a lot of overlapping with the chemicals we use a year later and in crop damage and stuff. So yeah, now very happy with running the 16 section system. We can do 600, 700 hours a year. Yeah, now a lot better now. Not the fatigue and stuff like that. It's, and we can achieve so much more. The self-propel seems so efficient and yeah, we've gained a lot of productivity. Purchasing Australia made is a bit of a priority. There's not too much Australia made stuff left. So yeah, very happy buying Australia made and getting that local support. Uh, yeah, definitely had a journey with Gold Acres. I've had three G6s and I've had tag alongs. I just, yeah, all the local parts. And now we've got a local 
dealer in town and yeah, very, very good and very lucky to have them close by.